This is KTVO's Good Morning Heartland. Welcome back. The annual Project Homeless Connect event is right around the corner. And to learn more about the event, we have Patty Preston with the Kirksville um, Housing Authority this morning to kind of break it down for us. How are you doing today? I'm well, thank you. Well, first of all, let's go ahead and talk about when the event will be taking place so all our viewers are aware of it. It will be this Friday, okay. October the 3rd, mm -hmm. from 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. So it's an all-day event, pretty much. It is an all-day event. So kind of explain to us um, what we can expect if we do plan on attending. Uh, we will have volunteers that will greet uh, folks coming in for services mm -hmm. that will take them to the different stations and uh, help hook them up with services that they might need. The mm -hmm. whole goal is to uh, prevent homelessness, to, to provide services for folks who are homeless. We're going to have service providers from all over the community. Mm -hmm. Volunteers will take uh, the participants to each station mm -hmm. where they can apply for some assistance or just get general information. Right. And any uh, answers to any questions they might have. How long Correct. have you uh, been doing this here in the Kirksville area? This is our second year. Okay. Mm -hmm. So obviously last year was the first year and yes. you probably had a really huge response to it. Then again, you're doing it again this year. Mm -hmm. So um, what do we need to bring if we want to attend? For participants who are looking to apply for services, mm -hmm. any kind of identification, picture okay. ID, birth certificates, social security cards, if you don't have those items, we are going to have uh, providers there to help you obtain those. Mm -hmm. We will have transportation to take you to, like the DMV or to the health department to get the birth certificate, that sort of thing. Kirktran will be providing free transportation that day, so, so individuals who wouldn't be able to participate or, mm -hmm. or get those services due to lack of transportation, they should be able to, to find a Kirktran bus on the regular fixed route mm -hmm. and, and get get to the event. Okay. Do we have to set some sort of appointment? I know that you had mentioned that it will be from 11 to 5. Mm -hmm. Is there any sort of appointment that, uh, appointment that we have to make or is it kind of walk-ins, welcome? How does that work? It's, it's totally walk-in and you okay. can come in and we're going to be, we're going to be providing um, free physicals. Uh, we will have um, stylists from hair salons providing free haircuts for folks. Oh. Um, yeah, no appointments necessary. Okay. Just come in and, and get hooked up with the services that are All necessary. Right. And you are, you said that you are providing free services to the people that attend. Now, does it cost anything to attend? There is no charge. Okay. Perfect. Not at all. Everything that, that we will be providing has been either donated, service providers are, are donating their time. Mm -hmm. So. Yeah, and who can no come to this event? Is it just Kirksville residents, Adair mm -hmm. County, beyond? How does that work? Uh, we, it, we're open to the surrounding communities. Okay. Uh, we've expanded a little bit this year. We, we've got some folks participating in, as service providers and donating items from uh, Knox County and places like that. Okay. So, yeah. And why is it so important to do something like this for community members? We want to provide services to, to folks that are homeless um, and folks that are on the verge of being homeless. Mm -hmm. uh, we want to give them a one-stop, one-day uh, place where they can go to, to get hooked up with things to either help, help house them mm -hmm. or prevent them from being homeless. They don't get those opportunities very often. So groups of service providers just come together on this one day and, and make it available. Individuals. So again, it will be taking place this Friday. This Friday. From 11 to 5. Mm -hmm. And where will it be taking place? I don't know we, if we mentioned that or not. Uh, no, we are at the Crossings Church okay. here in Kirksville. All right. And so mm -hmm. what we'll do is we'll post everything on our website at heartlandconnection.com and we'll post information with organizers of this event if you have any questions or concerns. Again, thank you so much, Patty, mm -hmm. for coming on. They can also visit our Facebook page. And I'll make sure to link all of yes. that on our, uh, on our website. Yes. Okay. Thank you so much. Uh-huh. Thank you. And we'll be right back.